Should you upgrade your Gen 3 Ryzen CPU? Are there any good CPUs out there? Or are the benefits too small to invest in Gen 3? The AM4 socket is coming to an end and now is the time for a cost-effective upgrade. The 5900X is a few years old by now, but the question is if it still has its bragging rights. And is Gen 3 high-end really good enough? Let's put it head-to-head -head with an overclocked 3600X and find out. Looking at raw computing power, the 5900X absolutely obliterates the 3600X. Twice the amount of cores and higher core speeds mean more than twice the performance. Even though the 3600X here is overclocked to 4.3 GHz, the 5900X walks away with this one. But will it make any difference in games? For the following tests, I'm using a 3070 Ti and I've tried to use repeatable comparable scenarios. FPS take a while to build up here, but after a while the 5900X pulls away and we can see a 50% increase and a higher GPU load. In this location we can see a 100% FPS increase as the 5900X keeps a very solid baseline and again loads the GPU much higher. Gameplay is much smoother with the higher FPS. As the 5900X once again pulls away, the GPU load gets so high that the recording software struggle to keep up. Gameplay is mostly smooth though. As we can see here, FPS in Star Citizen isn't always consistent, but the 5900X shows advantages in every situation. Even in this low CPU scenario, the 5900X is able to hold the V-Sync cap much more consistent. The GPU is under more load and the GPU dependent recording takes a dive. From a gameplay perspective, it's hard to tell the difference. Both are very similar.
even Battlefield 2042 gets a slight edge. So, do I think it makes sense to invest in your Gen 3 setup? Yes, I do. The CPU headroom allows you to do so much more with your PC, and the games are so much less sensitive to heavy scenarios.